Leah, as with most Lionesses games, a lot of build up and big excitement about this. How disappointed are you all in the dressing room? Yeah, really disappointed because I think the game was there to be won. And yeah, it was a fantastic occasion. Obviously, they never let us down, the fans, so shame not to be able to at least give them a win as well. From your perspective, where did you fall short this evening? Two set pieces. Well, yeah, second balls. Um, because I think we were we played we played well, not good enough because we didn't win the game. But I think the like I say, the chances were there to be to win it. Uh, but the set pieces, yeah, two set pieces have killed us. We spoke to your manager. She said frustration seems to be similar for yourself. What what was not quite happening, or was it communication wise for the set pieces? No, I just think um, obviously there's an element of luck to those things, but for us that's. Uh, first contact, second contact, so we just need to be better. We will be better Tuesday. Perfect response in terms of you get a, an opportunity to try and correct things straight away. What are you going to have to do better in St Etienne to get a more positive result? We need to be ruthless, need to put the ball in the back of the net, obviously. It uh, goes without saying, but um, yeah, we need to... You know, that's a must-win game now, absolutely. So we need to bring the energy, uh, stay, as, stay tight, limit everything they, they have and, and put them under pressure. Thanks very much for your time. Serena, it'll be a disappointing result. What's your thoughts on your side's performance tonight? Yeah, absolutely absolutely frustrating. Uh, I think we played pretty well. Um, and I think um, yeah, you, you, we can see two goals, two goals out, out of set plays, um, which, is a pretty, yeah, which we have to do really better. Um, in these matches, you don't get that many chances. I think the first half we created multiple chances and uh, we scored one which was good and then unfortunately they scored a goal and I think the second half we were yeah we were more on the ball we didn't create that much more chances but we were dangerous like the final pass needed to be better uh, just like we getting to a chance and then we didn't get there at the end one well, then we conceded the goal with the from the corner at the end we wanted to um, to force a goal but uh, that execution didn't go very well you say frustration. If we reference the set pieces, is that because you have instructed the players on what to do and they didn't quite fulfil what they were required when defending? Yeah, well, we know that France is really good at that part. And, um, of course, we were prepared. And, yes, they, they still got that time. I think in the first the first half was unlucky. I think um, Hempo was basically bombarded, I think. And the second uh, in the second stage, uh, she got just a little more... Uh, more space and she then she she finished it well too. Talk us through that opening half an hour because obviously it was the blow with Mary and a few unforced errors. It took a while for your side to really click into gear. Any thoughts on why that what might have been? Well, it was a strange start, of course. Uh, we started with that first uh, first ball and then Mary got injured and that took about I think about five minutes and then we got started and uh, and then uh, she went down again, of course, and then she had to be substituted. So that was. Um, yeah, that was not the way we, we were expecting it. Um, and, yeah, we had to get organised again. So And then later on we got it and then we, we started playing a lot better. As for Mary, you've seen her out on the pitch in crutches afterwards. What can you tell her about her injury status at the moment? Yeah, I can't say anything because I haven't spoken to anyone yet uh, straight after the game I came here. In terms of preparation, it's a very quick turnaround now. Do you need to tell the players much more? Is it just about recovery now because it's the same opposition on Tuesday evening? Yeah, yeah, of course. Uh, we're going to recover them, uh, also review the game, and then we get ready for Tuesday. There's uh, still lots, uh, lots uh, to win. Uh, this is disappointing. Um, and, uh, yeah, tomorrow review, then uh, that's done. And then we continue going to Tuesday and a new chance to, uh, to play a good game and win a game. Thank you very much for your time. Beth, obviously not the result you would have wanted. What's your reaction? Yeah, disappointed, frustrated. I actually thought we were the better team. We created more chances. The keeper made a really good save first half, but ultimately we got beat on two set pieces and that's something that we need to look at and rectify for Tuesday. I guess it's the sign when the world number two comes up against the world number three, it's going to be fine margins and as you mentioned, those set pieces in particular. Yeah, exactly. Um, yeah, it was a really tough game, you know, there's a lot of quality on show, but like you said, small margins and that won them the game today. Certainly the opening half an hour of Mary's injury, there's a few misplaced passes, it took a while to find the rhythm in the game. Yeah, obviously you don't want to lose your number one like that. Um, thought Hannah came on, made an amazing save, was amazing with her feet, but yeah, obviously we need to get our rhythm in the game early and we set ourselves on to play and perform better over the 90 minutes then.
Part of your job is scoring goals. I don't think an ex-Sunderland player has perhaps had a roar like that here. How was that for you tonight? Yeah, the reception's been amazing. The atmosphere's been great through the game. Um, just a shame it's not a goal that could have won us the game. Obviously, immediately now, but you go again in a few days' time. What do you think you need to do better out in France to turn this one around? Yeah, um, you know, we've got to get straight into recovery. We've got to watch and analyse the game and not give away set pieces, not concede from set pieces. And, yeah, we've got to rectify that and then change that again for Tuesday. Thanks for talking to us. Thank you.